So today we're gonna change the transmission oil of the van. It's not that we have problems, but uh, after 14 years, and I don't know if it has ever been replaced, so it's not a bad idea to do it. We are Nicky and Gert, a couple from tiny Belgium wanting to explore Europe and beyond. We converted our own camper van, Nigel, and together with our cats Nala and Sigi, we left on our big adventure. Together, we are Euronauts. So we have 3 liters of 75W90 and then the filler hole is located. I found it, so this is it. Remove this connector here and then should be able to remove this plug and then drain here and add 2.9 liters. So this is the drain plug and there is a magnet on top of it on top of it to catch all the metal shavings. So this these are all the metal shavings that have come off the, the gearbox in the time. So I think it's uh, not too bad, but the oil was definitely ready for a change. So this looks much better, I think. Yeah. So we fed a little tube into the breather hole and this is how we get it in. Nice and slow. 2.9 liters. For the torque for the drainage plug for the transmission is 50 newton meters. And you should use some thread locker as well according to the service manual. Another thing is uh, changing the oil, that's quite easy. You just need and a new oil filter. This is quite handy to uh, remove the oil plug. It's, uh, it's just an Allen key, 12 millimeters. And this is also handy, so this is to get a grip on the oil filter and get it loose quite easily. And of course, we have new oil. This time I went for uh, a brand, I went from Liqui Moly. We're not sponsored by the way, but uh, well, couldn't hurt and it's not that expensive, so yeah. Let's go. There we go. Also pretty black, despite it being only changed uh, last year. There was probably still some gunk in it that came loose because we drove it quite a bit now. So, oil motor oil, quite black. And then this is the transaxle oil or the transmission oil. Also, not what it should be. It's very dark. And as you can see, this is supposed to be five liters, and I think only two came out. So it's, it's probably not a bad call to uh, to change this. So we just poured the oil into this big as. Uh, Now we're gonna check the oil level first. All right, so this is the dipstick. It's a bit, it's a bit above the max, but uh, should be fine. 